17 to 12, the final score here inside Kinnick Stadium as we visit with head coach James Franklin. And coach, what an unbelievably gritty, hard fought victory for your program. Yeah, I, I couldn't be more proud of the guys, you know, really in all three phases. I thought the first quarter, you know, we played like a young football team on offense. We are just antsy in the pocket and dropping some balls and just, just weren't as clean as we've been. But after that, you know, I thought we did just enough to win the game in terms of whether it was touchdowns or field goals or reserving the right to punt, pinning them deep. Blake did a great job of pinning them deep and then and then obviously play great defense so um, we also didn't turn the ball over which is huge this is a tough place to play you know just you look over the last four years there's been a bunch of ranked opponents come in here and and lose uh, so you know i couldn't be more proud of how we played complimentary smart disciplined hard-nosed blue-collar penn state football you mentioned the special teams aspect of things. I was going to ask you that because Blake obviously flipped field positions quite a bit and that played such a critical role today, but just how big was that? Yeah, I, I thought it was huge. You know, uh, we were able to pin them deep. Our defense was able to keep them deep, give our offense good field position, and then we either scored with that field position or pinned them deep again. So, you know, I, I couldn't be more proud of our guys and how we manage the game today. I thought that was the big thing. I thought we managed the game well. Um, so we just want to know. We got we to gotta enjoy it. We got to learn from it. There's things that we can get better at. There's no doubt about it. Uh, and we'll work on those things all week long. Um, but I'm proud. A lot of critical plays in this one, but obviously that brisk interception kind of changed the momentum of things a little bit. And then Noah Kane, who's off to our left here, pounded one in for you guys. But how big of a sequence was that in that game? Yeah, I, I couldn't be more proud. You look at Brisker, he's done a great job you know, since he stepped on campus. And then, you know, the, the, the young man out of Texas slash Louisiana, um, he's a downhill guy. You know, he breaks tackles, he falls forward. Um, He's productive, you know, he's productive and he's got just such a sense of maturity to him. So, you know, really proud. And I, you know, you got to give our O-line and tight ends credit. You got to, you got to give our coaches credit because I think the diversity in our running game is so much better than it's been in the past. That helps us in four minute offense. We haven't been able to, do, we haven't been able to do that in six years, six years in the old offense and the new offense, the years we won the Big Ten championship. Um, we haven't been able to run the ball against a really good defense and end the ball on our terms, make them burn all three timeouts. So that's, that's a real positive. Coach, appreciate your time and congratulations on the victory. Thank you so much.